Today, I will explain how you can connect the CMF Watch Pro 2 with your mobile phone. I am using an iPhone for this tutorial, but it is the same for iOS and Android. Grab your watch and press the side button to initiate setup. Then you have to choose your language. I am selecting English. After this, you'll get a QR code on your watch to install the companion app. Just point your camera at this QR and click on the link that pops up. This will open either the App Store or the Google Play Store to download and install the app. Or simply, you can just search for the CMF Watch on the App Store or Play Store to install this app. After installing it, open the app. First, you need to give notification permissions to this app. After this, log into the app. You can choose either of the login options. I'm logging in using my Google account, so I'm tapping on Sign in with Google. Next, grant permissions to the app by tapping the Continue button. Now, select the Google account you want to use for the login and tap Continue. The sign-in process will start. I logged in successfully. Now, allow the app to access your location and grant permissions to track activity according to your preference. This will be followed by a prompt for Bluetooth access. Tap on Allow. Next, set your preferred unit settings and tap on Next. Enter the date of birth and hit Next. On the following screen, select your gender. I choose male. After that, I enter my height and weight and then tap on complete button to finish the setup process. Here you can see how I set up my CMF Watch app. Next, I need to connect CMF Watch Pro 2 by nothing with this app. On the upper right corner, tap on this plus icon or at the bottom, you can see four options. Tap on the watch icon. Tap on add devices. The search is completed and you can see that the Watch Pro 2 is available to connect. But sometimes the watch is not available here. So tap on the QR code scan icon and give it camera access permission. After this, scan the watch's QR code to pair with it. I got a pop-up on the CMF Watch Pro 2 as a binding request. I tap on allow it. It started pairing. The second notification I received on my phone is a Bluetooth pairing request. Tap the pair button. Watch setup is completed. Now tap on try it out. Here you can see the battery level of my Watch Pro 2. It is 100%. Below this, you can see the dial gallery and I can change the watch face from it. In the upcoming videos, I will tell you the best watch face for your CMF Watch Pro 2. So subscribe to this channel, this will help you to stay updated. Now let's use the watch. I tap the crown button to see the home screen. Swipe up to check the notification. Here you will see all the notifications. For the control panel, swipe down. This is helpful to change various settings quickly like changing brightness and setting it on auto. The auto brightness level is not available in the CMF Watch Pro. If you want to check out more differences between the CMF Watch Pro 2 and Watch Pro, then tap on the i button to watch our video. If you swipe left, you will get different tiles like activity tracking, health tracking, music control, calls and contacts. To access the menu, tap on the crown button. And I can use this crown button to navigate it. You can see how I scroll the menu by using the crown button. You can also check out how many apps there are for a better experience. I tap on settings and then watch face setting. Here I can go through the watch faces just by rotating the watch crown button. This watch face looks good to me, so I am selecting it by tapping. The watch face also shows complications like Samsung and Apple watches. I can change these complications by tapping on them. Now I want to show you another watch face. This watch face design can be changed by rotating the crown button. I like this feature. That's it for today. Subscribe to Wearholic if you want more videos on the CMF Watch Pro by nothing. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and comment down any queries. See you in the next video. Until then, goodbye.